Welcome to Nelly's Nook. My name is Nelly, and today I will share with you how to calculate quickly and easy uh, your first starting page for book folding. My pattern is asking for 449 pages, and I need a book height minimum of 22 centimeters. So my book is 22 and a half, which is wonderful. That's more than enough for my pattern. And now we will be calculating how many pages in total do I have in my book. This book is showing me that I have 557 number pages. We will calculate all the pages that are able to be fold. Okay, so past that number, I have one, two, three, four, five pages that I can still fold. So let's calculate the five on the back. And let's see on the front. This is my, this is four, three, two, and one. That will be now my number one page. So I have extra one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve pages. So in total, I have 12 pages. So let's calculate that. That will be 4, 7, and 5. So that's a total number of pages that I have in my book. However, my pattern is asking for only 449 pages. So let's subtract 449 pages. And that will give me 5. Okay, so... Those are extra pages. I have 125 extra pages in, in this book. Just because I want to have it even in the front and in the back, I will divide it by two. And that will give me approximately da, 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 62 and half pages. Okay, well, we cannot use half. So we will use 62. That will be our magic number. It means that I will have 62 pages in the front and 63 pages in the back. So 62 is my magic magic number that I will be working with my pattern on. So if my number is 62, I have to put it right here, 62, plus my number page is 1. So my starting page will be number 63. Start. So my pattern will be starting on my page 63. So page one in my pattern will be page 63 in the book, in my book. So if I go somewhere else and I want to do pattern numbers on page 60, uh, 93, I will add 62 plus 93. And that all together will be 155. So pattern, page pattern number 93 will be on book page 155. And you just find 155. So this way, when you make a mistake, you cut too much, um, you cut not enough. Sometimes you miss a cut. You can always find the mistake and find out what the measurement is supposed to be on that page. So if I go, I make a mistake on, on uh, page 121 in my pattern, I have to just add plus 62, and then it will give me 183. So I will find that mistake on my page book, uh, book page uh, number 183. And that's all it is. You just follow your pattern <clears throat> as you have it, and just add the number that you calculate um, according to your to your pattern and to your book pages and you should be good to go hope you will enjoy your book folding pattern and i will see you next time